So here we are at the vet. We made our car trip and we're ready to go in and see Dr. Amanda. Yeah. Waiting to see Dr. Amanda. I'm just generally being hellions and being naughty. And that's my toes, don't bite them. And just, yeah, having fun, <laughs> waiting for the vet. Don't eat my shoes, please. Thank you. Little Mr. Sparrow. Always in your lap. Always, always. Lark also very cuddly. Robin also very cuddly. Phoebe and Wren raising hell. Well, there's Wren now. Swift eating my shoe. Don't eat my shoe. That's Phoebe and Jay destroying the hell. I'm having a good time waiting for the vet. Jay fell asleep at Jay's feet. Well, his real name is Jason, but he's wearing red socks and red pants and Jay's collar is red. So I think it was, fate. as we, yeah, as we say it in, in Yiddish Bersher, it's meant to be, but yeah, fate. And uh, one of the texts came in and apparently has a toy poodle that looks like Lark, except Lark will be 40 pounds or 45 pounds and her toy poodle is probably five pounds. <laughs> So Ren is showing her, demonstrating her brilliance by using her paws, but also demonstrating her full of beansness by being the last one standing. This is what's going on with everybody else. And Ren's like, I'm happy to be here. Want to do stuff? All done at the vet, and everybody is very tired and sleepy. And for what? Reasons only known to himself, Sparrow was sleeping by himself. A very busy time at the vet. Everybody came home for milk and kibble, a snack. They all had their vet appointments. Everybody had good hearts. Everybody had good hawks. Everybody had good everything. So that was a nice visit at Timberley and a good way to end the day. And as you can see, Wendy is still a super good mom.